Okay, so we are going to be learning how to do the Corona Check uh, COVID-19 um, rapid test. And so anytime you deal with a suspected COVID-19 patient, you need to wear the PPE that is recommended by the CDC. So gloves, gown, and uh, face protection. So face shield and the mask. And especially if you are collecting a specimen for COVID-19, it's imperative that you wear proper PPE. Okay, so the materials that you need, you'll have your Corona Check cassette, your buffer, and your micro pipette. So you want to take the cassette out of the wrap. Okay, now you're drawing in a um, green top tube. So this is what you'll be drawing in and you'll have to spin it down. So it, you're using the plasma off of the green top separator tube. And of course you'll label it with the patient's first and last name and with their birth date. Okay, so you'll take the lid off and with the micro pipette, you're going to suck up the serum up to the black line. Now when you suck it up, you can actually suck it up into the well up above, but then just push down to the black line. Okay, so you're going to put the, the plasma into the well that's labeled S for sample. So you'll squeeze that in and you'll see that it's yellow. Then you'll use the buffer and you'll put in two drops of buffer into the well labeled B for buffer. It's really easy. Okay, and then you'll set your timer for 10 minutes. Now, if you have to give it at least 10 minutes and no longer than 20 minutes to interpret the reading. Okay, now you can see uh, the buffer go up the cassette and um, that's what you wanna see. Okay, here's the final result um, and it is a negative. So when you read the result, where it says C, that's your control, you must have a line there at the C. You, so if you have a positive, you have IgG and IgM, and you can have either or both of those red lines, and that is a positive. Now one of them is that you have a current infection going on, and the other one is that you have the antibodies that um, you have had a past infection and your provider will be the one to determine that. If you have one of these other lines, red and no control line, it's invalid. So you must always have a control line. So you can have a positive with all three lines present or you can have a positive with just two lines present.